American but a human being to honestly think that we can fathom the concept of God. I think that in itself is a pride issue. I think God, I think God is, I'll tell you why, I think God is just so much bigger than us. How do you think that? Because that is what I believe. I believe for someone, you believe. No, 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 hold on, hold on, let me finish, let me finish. Let me finish. Do you believe that God created the earth? Don't believe. It is an accepted fact, yes. It's an accepted fact. How do you know that? By looking at the evidence. And what is the evidence? All around you, everything. Well, a monkey could have created it. Why God? A monkey could have created it. I, I, what is your point? What is your point? What is your How can you just... What is your point? Very easy. What is your point? Very easy. Is that what you think? You think you're great? No, no, no. You have... One second. We have Let's leave God aside for one minute. We human beings have this incredible ability which two monkeys don't have. You use the example. Yes? I mean. Now, one second. Two monkeys cannot talk the way me and you are doing. That is correct. Now, how can you even think that a monkey could have created all this? I'm not saying a monkey. I'm just saying it could be. There's an example, but if you follow this example, you see the point is. But whatever I say, the amazing thing is that it immediately digresses from what we have said. Because I am clearly saying, look around you. I'm basing everything on an objective plane. Yeah. Okay. Now, what you have said without realizing it, is the problem is that we are trying to fathom this God. And when I say, how do you know you are saying, I think. No, I you are, you I are believe. You. Oh, oh now there's a difference. It is something, no, no, I just say that. I can't believe any quote from you, so I just say Precisely. believe. Precisely, but you see. It is something that is indescribable. It is an emotion that wells up inside of me. It is something I have been taught from the beginning, and it's also based on first experience of that God. Sister, I can accept that, but a devil worshiper has the same feeling. And that's fair enough. That's but is that true? That is up to them. Is that, it, is this, it is what I'm, this is what I'm saying to you, to that that is totally up to them. But is it true? Whoever, You're not answering whoever, whoever, I have no experience. Is it true? I have no experience of the devil. Sister, is it true? I have no experience of that, so I can't say that. Sorry, Paul. Sister, is it true? I, I can't answer that question because I have no experience of devil work. Let me put my head on the blanket. Let me put my head on the blanket. You don't need to. Hold on, hold on the blanket. No, it's not true. Oh, thank you. You see, if you take it further, we are finding an impact. You see, like you just did. You just said, well, I'm not a devil worshiper. I don't know. I'm saying to you, I'm saying to you, devil worshippers will tell you exactly what you are telling me. They believe in the we devil. Just, Which is fair enough. We just felt it. But my question is, and that's why I asked him, how on an objective plane can I establish whether you had a true experience or the devil worshipper had a true experience? Well, how not, do I do it? It's not up to you. This is what I'm saying to you. It's not up to you. Nobody has to explain themselves to you. Everybody has a right to ask for themselves and for you, you and for you to to do what they believe in. So, Nobody has to. Nobody, nobody has to answer to you. Nobody has I agree to prove anything to you. I agree. So can you explain why we have five major religions who all claim to be from God? But it's totally up to them. Everybody has a right to live so why are you talking and worship. To me? I'm talking to you purely because I heard you pass a comment and I but felt why like did I you? Why? Purely because why? I felt like I needed to express why? my opinion. Because I felt like I needed to express my opinion. That's the amazing thing. I'm entitled to express my opinion. I might not be entitled to express my opinion. No, you weren't. I'm not entitled to express my opinion. Your belief. You just said, no, they, everybody is just, yes, that's what you said. I have, you said everybody should be left alone, so you should have been there for I, 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 no, no, I did not, I did not say, I did not say, I did not say everybody should be left alone. Don't put, don't put words in I did not say everybody should be left alone. I said everybody has a right to live in whichever way they want to. I did not say everybody should be left alone. You felt, yes, listen to me, you felt, now, take it further one step. You read the Bible? Yes, I did. Okay, let's take it. I'm not an expert on it, but yes, I did. Don't worry about that. Because if I put anything else, you say, well, I'm not them. You are a Bible reader. If the Bible tells you, as I told my friend Paul here, prove all things, hold on to that which is good and pure. Okay? When it says prove all things, how do I do it? No, I mean, I, I think... Why are you offending the system? I'm not offending, I just said to you, if you can't answer it, I will, I will take it. Okay, okay. And listen, you be nice to me, okay? No, I'm not. I'm not exactly... So this guy's got to be nice to the lady, huh? Yeah. All right, all right. Being nice to you. Can't you see how handsome I am? You're jealous. You've got to get right. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. No, what I am saying here is, I'm not trying to be some Christian, you have to believe in my God. What I'm saying is... I don't is, take I my question. Is, no, I'm not, because... I, what was I'm, my question? I'm coming, I'm coming.